Hey everyone, Sandeep here from 99signals and I'm back with another review and tutorial of a SaaS tool that has been a game changer for my agency. Now this tool is called Review Studio and it's an online proofing platform that helps you take control of the whole feedback and approval process in your agency. So if you run an agency like me, then it would make sense for you to invest in this tool because it can really reduce the friction that is involved in the whole feedback process. Now, if you're not using an online proofing platform for your agency, the whole feedback process can be a little complicated. You would have to get things approved and reviewed over email or Slack or Skype or uh, project management tools like Trello and Asana. So it can be a little time consuming and there can be a lot of confusion in the whole process. Now, if you use an online proofing platform like Review Studio, it will ensure that it removes all the friction from your creative workflow and your team can be on the same page when it comes to all the collaborative projects. What this tool effectively does is it allows you to gather feedback effectively on your content, uh, whether it's a video file or a PDF or uh, a photo shoot or a bunch of graphics or any other creative work that you're involved with. Now, apart from helping you gather feedback effectively, it can also help you present your work professionally to your clients and it can seamlessly help you track creative work from conception to completion. So in this video, I'll show you how Review Studio works. But uh, before that, to test out all the features that I'm going to uh, explain in this video, I would highly recommend you sign up for a 15 day free trial of Review Studio. This trial will give you access to all the advanced settings and annotation tools to gain a deeper understanding of how online proofing works on Review Studio. You can find a link in the description of this video. So before we get on to the demo, I would highly recommend that you sign up for a 15 day trial. Now let's jump right in to the demo of Review Studio. To get started, uh, you just have to enter your account domain here, preferably your company name or the name of your blog or the name of your agency whatever works for you and once the domain has been created uh, anyone from your team can access this subdomain in their browser and log into their individual dashboard of review studio with their login credentials once you've logged into the review studio dashboard and added all the users you can directly enter the review canvas and start reviewing the file that you just uploaded now like i said you can upload any file format here in fact if you go to the review studio website and check out their features you'll see all the different formats that are supported so you can bunch all these files into a single review let's say your team is working on a specific instagram campaign for your client and you have to get a bunch of different images, videos and other marketing collaterals reviewed and approved. You can upload all those files here and you can combine them into a single review. For the purpose of this demo, I would like to keep things simple. So I've just uploaded this single file, which is a YouTube thumbnail that my designer made recently. So this is the first version of the file and I have a few comments that I would like to make. And this will be a great way to show you how the whole review process works on Review Studio. So what you're seeing now is the review canvas of uh, Review Studio. This is where you can use the different uh, annotation tools that are at your disposal. For example, you have the draw pin where you can draw around a certain element that you would like to change. You have the comment pin, which is pretty useful and it's the one that I'll be using for this specific review. And then you have different annotation tools like arrow, square, circle, and you can even change the color of the different annotation tools that you will be using. So for this specific purpose, I'll use the comment pin. So I can just uh, drop this comment pin over a specific element in this graphic that I would like to change. So I'll briefly show you how the annotation works on uh, Review Studio. Uh, for instance, in this graphic, let's say I want to change the font size of Review. I want to make it smaller. So I just drop the comment pin here and uh, I can add my comment and then I can just post it. And uh, as you can see, the comment will appear on the right side. Similarly, let's say I want to remove this particular subtitle because it's a YouTube thumbnail and uh, most likely it will not even be visible in the thumbnail. So I'll just drop the comment pin here and add my comment and post it. Now in this particular section, there is a question mark missing after skip it. So I can just drop the comment pin here and tell my designer to add a question mark. And then finally, let's say I want to remove this AppSumo Lifetime Deal logo entirely. I can drop the comment pin here and add my comment. 
Now all the comments that I've added to this particular graphic will appear on the right side and my designer can respond to these comments once she has made all the specific changes or if she has any questions she can just reply to any of these comments and add her question now when my designer receives the link uh, she just needs to copy the same link uh, into her browser and log in with her uh, login credentials and it will directly open the review canvas where she'll see all the annotations and my comments and all the changes that are required to this graphic and once she has made all the changes she can upload a new version of the file by clicking here and when she uploads the new file this will be replaced with the new graphic now if i were to share this file with my client for approval then i can do that here by going to actions and clicking on share file and going to guests this is where i can add as many guests as i want so in this case uh, let's assume that this particular email address belongs to my client and then i'll have to uh, select these two options here where I'm allowing guest access to the file and where these specific guests can approve the graphic or suggest changes. So I can simply copy this link and share it with my client. And when they open this particular link in their browser, they just have to enter their email address and then click on enter review. And this is where they can suggest changes again with the annotation tools and they can add their own comments. But if they're happy with the graphic, they can just click on submit decision and hit approve. So this is how the whole feedback and approval process works on Review Studio. Like I said, you can group multiple files into a single review or you can do it for individual files. Depends on how you work at your agency and the different projects that you work with. So the bottom line is Review Studio really helps you streamline the whole feedback and approval process at your agency. That wraps up this uh, review and demo of Review Studio. Like I said, uh, a 15 day free trial is available on all these plans. So based on your goals, you can pick any of these plans and try it out for uh, 15 days to check out all the key features and how the feedback and approval process works on Review Studio. And then you can decide to invest in any of these plans. Thank you so much for watching this uh, review and demo of Review Studio. Hope you found it useful and I'll be back very soon.